Yeah, and now he's dead. Well then. Had to see what happened. Hey! It's me, Marky Joe, here to entertain you. Yes, it is my show. It exists. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Uh, I don't know what to expect with this map, but I suspect enemies will show up. Bing! Bong! Bing! Bong! That's just for sinking purposes. And let's do this! Alright, monies. Too bad we don't have any money. Alright, well at the very least we could check what's in these houses. Alright, falling moon. Hold on. No. Hold on, let me just check. Effective against dragons. I'm gonna need that. Original drains OC energies. Wow. Well, I mean, uh, unless it's Nosferatu, it's not fucking worth my time. Let me just point that out. Yeah, he doesn't have uh, dark magic access, so... Having stronger magic tomes isn't really a big thing, so long as he can deal just enough damage to uh, screw things... screw up the enemy. The word bed looks like a bed? Huh. Well, I wouldn't say my mind is blown, but that is some pretty interesting trivia right there. Oh my god, 90,000 gold, that's a lot. Alright, there has to be something- there has to be more to this than simply what I'm looking at right now. Yeah, I already know that. Thank you for letting me know. Oh, I could do this. Yeah! Oh, it must be Link. Alright, well, that was friendly. Huh. Alright, fair enough. Whoa! It's, uh... It's Nicolas Cage! I think... I might be wrong, but... Still, that's pretty amazing. Damn it! Give me money! Oh, I can't visit these. Okay, what's in here? Ooh, Fancy Slicer, huh? For our amazing Mary Sue... Like, character thing or whatever. I don't know, I would call these characters Mary Sue's. They're just boring. Whoa! Shit. Alright, Dio, calm the fuck down. D you know what? Dio Brando from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure should meet, uh... Riss from Fire Emblem 1. <laughs> Bottom right corner. Well, I'm inclined to trust your word. Oh, di oh shit! It's it's Hatsune Miku, uh, Megurin Luka, and whoever the fuck is on the right. All right. Well then, that was a uh, wonderful use of our time. What's here? Whoa! Alright. <laughs> this one's pretty funny. Uh, so that's probably a Finding Nemo reference. Alright. We get it. How long does this go? Does this loop? That would be pretty hilarious. Alright. I have a feeling that if I... Okay, good. I have a feeling that if I just read it all the way through, everything would be fine. Or that I'd get a secret hint. Oh, for crying out loud.
Come on! I know you have something valuable to say! You're gonna catch me at the last moment. You're gonna say something very useful and I'm gonna press the A button by accident. Come on! Yes, I am patient. <laughs> Well, no. I mean, judging by my reactions, probably not. Meme Lord in less than 20 minutes? Oh, I don't get the item? Fuck you! Would have been awesome! Oh, it's Glitch Demon. Okay, or Ko. New team member? Oh, damn it. Okay, hold on. Maybe if I visit that one again. Maybe with a different person? I have a feeling I'm just wasting. Th Is that Seto Kaiba? I swear to God. No, that doesn't look like him. Alright. So now we have money. So literally, Boast Feratu. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. But what use would that be? Both sadistic joy. All right. <clears throat> so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna shop in these houses. So now that you know what's in the shops, I'm just gonna skip ahead to when I leave this area. And I think the only thing I need to explain is that the black rose from the land shop penetrates the fence and is super powerful. That's it. It's not actually very useful though. All right. So, with that said, let's visit the new area. Oh, there was a treasure chest in the bottom left. Shit. Oh, it's me! Hey! For once, I'm not the main character. Amazing! Dude, I would totally pay them. They've been through a lot. Yeah, it was out of character. Why, why am I a villain if I'm just out of character anyway? Oh, okay, that's a big map. Ten gold. We got way more than we needed from that one chick. Swoosh. <laughs> okay. I don't know how pos how possible this is gonna be with my current equipment, but well, let's see how well it goes. If it goes poorly, then uh, oh well. Okay. Now I can go here. Do I have Boast for Atu? Yes, I do. So now I can just kind of destroy them very easily. Yeah, oh shit. This, this is practically tailored for that purpose. All right, so I don't have to open that door then. Also, this is a really laggy map. All right, let's do this. Attack if you dare. Oh, they won't. Damn, well that sucks. Oh, that means we gotta do it slow. And slow it is. Holy fucking shit is it slow. So, I'm gonna be speeding up this footage just a tiny bit. Oh my god. The lag. This is bringing back memories of uh, our good old buddy, um, F.exe. Okay. Let's see how that does against them. They're flying enemies, so I presume this does extra effectiveness damage to them. All right, come on, really? You're not gonna have a single one attack us? Yeah, so basically, none of the enemies in this chapter move. They'll attack you if you're in their range, but that's about it. So this part becomes super tedious, and it's not particularly challenging. So we're gonna be doing a montage of all the nonsense that commenced. But I can, like, seriously mess these guys up, especially with something like Boast Feratu. I mean, come on, dude. Oh, yeah, give me that juice. 
Oh, that's something Evil Ego Waffle would say. <laughs> I can't wait to, like, clear most of these enemies off the map, though, because right now, oh, not the slightest bit tolerable. Okay, good. Juice. <laughs> oh, man, this bow makes things too easy. I mean, a Nosferatu that, has, that deals effectiveness damage. Come on, man. That's super broken. You know what else is broken? Damn it. Damn it! Fucking... Okay. I should probably point out, uh, why the fuck is there no animation for that? <laughs> like, a proper animation? Bam. All of your health is mine. I mean, if you had, like, herpes or something, that isn't that also part of your health? That would... Nosferatu, in some circumstances, would probably be not the most practical thing to have around. All right, come on. Do it. Damn it! All right, I'm just gonna have Pert and Original take care of everything, because honestly, these other two guys aren't good at much. I should probably save up the Nosferatu for when I really need it. Because clearly I don't need it against these losers. Oh gee whiz, I got XP! Yeah. Attacking this guy straight up. Not the brightest idea. Alright, but that's why I got the Ballista. It's also why I could potentially use this, but yeah, that's not gonna work. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, I, I think I'm just gonna have to whittle down his health slowly and painfully. Damn it! How many times have you gone without doing a crit? Shit, man! Surprise, motherfucker! There we go! That's what I like to see. Also, Lion has some amazing poses in his Necromancer animation. All right, let's see what this animation actually looks like, though. Oh my god. It is literally- Oh my god, and it has no Sprawtu effect! Holy shit! Oh my god, I am gonna abuse the fuck out of that now! Meanwhile, you can go die, Alpha. That is your real name. Okay, so Boast Fratu and Falling Moon. Need to keep that in mind. All right. What's in here? More elixirs. Damn it. Oh my god, this is kind of a long, tedious battle, huh? What the? Open the chest to clear, okay. Oh, wait. Rage oozes forth, yes. Oh, the Fag Lance! <laughs> ah, back from Clockinator's old days of making his one submission. Oh, okay. I guess that's just off screen now. All right, use the moon. All right, go. And these guys don't move as well. All right. <sighs> I think I know what is actually being expected of me now. I think what the game wants is for you to completely ignore the enemies. Uh, I should have gathered that, actually, from the way the game reacted to certain things. Well, like, from the dialogue, rather. Yeah, you know what? I think that makes a lot more sense. Also, this might... Yeah, this is gonna put me at very low health. Alright. Oh, you actually move? What the fuck? Uh-oh. Glitch demon? Yep, it's glitch demon. That's not good. Okay. So yeah, things are expected to get a little crazy here, it appears. Damn it! Fuck! Ah! Uh, this is annoying, man. 
F.E.X. F.E.X.P. was clearly not built for this. For future reference, guys, whenever you make maps in F. Uh, F.E.X.P., try not to make ones with shitloads of enemy units like this, because it causes the game to slow down, like, unbelievably much. We gotta make a fucking... we gotta hurry. Yeah, because Glitch Man is coming through. I'm gonna have to do this. Good. Wait, what? Alright. I don't know what the fuck that was all about, but I have a bad feeling nonetheless. Alright. Come on, surprise motherfucker him. Surprise motherfucker. There we go. <laughs> Can I just say, Original is the best character. Like, he's... <laughs> that animation is so fucking funny. This will actually buy me more time, because uh, the enemies will be too busy. Um, well, Glitch will be too busy dealing with these enemies. Also, I think I fucked up. Yeah, I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Come on, prove me right. Okay, you're- well, I mean I'm grateful, I guess. Bam. Too bad there's no explodey arrow, but, I mean, whatever. That'll do. Oh my god, are you serious? That guy just went and blocked Glitchman's way. Alright, that works for me. Okay, so now I know that I need to rush. Wait, how close? You're right there, why are you not attacking? Alright, whatever, I'm not gonna complain too loudly. So I briefly went over this in part two, but Ko usually attacks anybody, regardless of their alliance. She'll attack enemies, she'll attack allies, it doesn't matter. So when she didn't attack that nomadic trooper, I should have taken that as a sign of what's to come. Okay, so there is a way to, to get through this without hitting these guys. And it looks like that's exactly what we're intended to do. Yeah, we're just, just supposed to, like, walk through them, I guess. And kill this guy. Who the fuck is this guy? Oh, wait. The game mentioned somebody by the name of Bob at some point but I don't remember the exact details behind it. Alright, this would have been... I guess what I should have done is I should have gotten that weapon that ignores defense so that I could just tear through these guys. Either that or I'll just make this party easier later on. Wait. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so you can walk through them. Oh, that is bad. That is all sorts of bad for me and for everyone involved. Yeah, so considering I have to walk through a hallway of generals, and this guy can walk through all enemy units, you can see where this is going, right? Alright, now things are getting a bit more interesting now that I understand the map is it is designed in, in a way... It's like intentionally designed to be tedious. Well, alright. Who the fuck is the weeaboo you are referring to, anyway? Alright, so th those are more dragons, I think. Oh! Ooh, Haxers! Wait, can I promote somebody again, then? Ah, uh, fucking stupid-ass dragons. I probably gotta kill them, too, I realize. Oh my god, I have to target through all these goddamn enemies. And watch the fucking animation. Oh. <laughs> why did you tell why did you force me to have these on, man? Make things so much better if I could just turn that shit off. Yeah, I think I might be screwed actually. Yeah, you're literally right there. I can't do anything about you.
Oh, and of course. Yeah, that's fucked up. I can't do it. Alright, I'll be right back. Let's figure out what's in that chest, shall we? Oh, it's just an elixir. Alright, so here's the thing. This is how I have my units set up. <laughs> Instead of giving him the falling moon, I gave him all this crap. Because, one, we're, we're fighting against a lot of dragons, and the dragons are the bosses. Uh, he's gonna need that quite a bit. And since it hits consecutively, that means that he's gonna be our main dragon killer. He also has bolting to make our life easier. And for side, I got him the Black Rose, which is the only, like, super expensive weapon. Because it ignores defense and it allows me to break through that big wall of, uh, generals. As for our thief dude, I don't think he's gonna be much good for anything. So, I'm just gonna let him be. His main purpose is probably to just, um, open up doorways and shit. Alright, so... Let's see if we can do this proper now, shall we? Hey guys, guess what ended up being completely useless? The Black Rose weapon! However, I did manage to defeat one of the dragons up here. Uh, Mark, Mark says like, Hey, that was my favorite one! Which is pretty funny, but I mean, whatever. I don't care. See, that's the difference between me and them. Okay, I need to destroy these guys as fast as possible, though. Uh, which is a tall order, might I add. Um, please don't attack first. Okay, for some reason... Ah, uh, that's right, some of them have van vantage. So, I guess that's why I was suddenly paranoid, even though I wasn't before. Okay, I probably... What the fuck did I... Oh, I got the, uh, the Haxers. Yeah. So, I, oh my god, the lag is so intense right now. Yeah, check it out. It only does 35 damage, so you need three hits. And even if you miss, it wastes durability on the weapon. Uh, now, I suspect that it, it's because of a design oversight by Yeti when he made this engine. But in Game Boy Advance Fire Emblem... Uh, the only weapons that would deplete even if they missed was magic, and that makes sense, because you're casting magic and it's, you know... But with, like, with weapons, even if those, like, if those miss, they're not, you're not wasting their durability, because they're not hitting anything and becoming weaker as a result, you know? It doesn't make any sense. I mean, it does make sense. Um, but yeah, I, I suspect that's a design oversight by our good old buddy Yeti. Surprise, motherfucker. Damn it. I'll... Ugh, man, I gotta stop, like, constantly asking for crits and stuff. It's not interesting commentary, man. <laughs> Could you not? <laughs> yeah. Uh, sorry, but I kind of have to. You're forcing my hand here. You didn't pay me. I mean, why the fuck... Like, how hard is it to pay ten friggin' gold, man? It's not a lot to ask for. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I'm not expecting, like, super high-quality plot shit here. Uh, but it would certainly be nice if, uh, that was added. Who the fuck... D doesn't... Doesn't Bob drop Haxers? He did, but you dropped it because you're a fucking idiot. I guess he didn't. How strange. Because I was hoping I could promote this dude. Oh, and by the way, check it. Get out. Yeah, I haven't hit with a single one of those, by the way. <clears throat> so that Black Rose is a complete waste of time, and it's way too overpriced and shit. It's, uh... It's a worthy investment. <coughs> okay. So, I'm guessing that I got pushed the very tempting button in the middle of the room. I mean, uh, oh... No, yeah, I think that's what it wants me to do. Alright, please. Alright. So, this is basically a riddle, and at first I thought that this had something to do with what the old man in the village said, you know. Good things happen to those who wait. But no, that's... that has nothing to do with it, actually. Instead, you have to do something else. 
And I'm just going to skip to that part because watching me figure this shit out is not interesting to watch. Okay, so this clue. Whoop. Bring in this here. Look at your options carefully. Guess what you have to do? Look at the options and go to show objective. Six spaces left, eight, two down. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. Okay, so that's the tile. I'm glad I asked the author about that because I don't think I could have figured that out on my own. I'm not smart enough for that shit. Also, I promoted side. Give me one moment. Okay. Yeah, we're good. Okay, so I just needed to check that and make sure that my microphone was working properly. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Visit. What the hell does this do? Wow. Alright. No explanation, we just teleport here. Never. God, this is so fucking stupid. Damn it, why'd I have to be so strong? Oh, Princess Bride reference. Alright, well then. Is that literally... <laughs> oh my god, my head's like peeking out of that big obnoxious costume. That's funny. Can you do enough damage to fuck somebody up? I hope not. You can kill him in one hit. That's insanely bad. Okay, but if... Ah, oh, that means that we're all forced to come close to him. Wow, that's actually kind of interesting for a boss fight thing. Okay, now that he targeted that guy, stupid... Oh, oops. Oh, damn. Uh, that's not... That's hardly something to be, like, concerned about. Yeah, see? <laughs> God damn it, Mark! God damn it, me! So it's worth noting that since you have a time limit, you want to play this submission fast, and for that, I recommend that instead of getting any of the other legendary weapons in the shops, you should get Pert's Arc. That's his legendary bow thing. It deals 20 damage at base, and it deals extra damage to wyverns, and since most of the bosses in this chapter are wyverns, that actually makes it super good. It's also just good in general for, de for dealing with the bosses, especially if you can double them. So in this remaining footage, if you're wondering why I'm not using, like, Falling Moon or whatever, you know why now. Let's see how this works out. Alright. Thief Man has to be up close to him, no matter what. That cannot be changed. Alright, we already saw this dialogue. Okay, good. Don't double him, please. Okay, good. Ugh. Every time the screen scrolls, I always think that there's going to be doubling commencing. Okay, so now that his defenses are significantly lowered, I can do this. Oh, that's not good. Oh! Oh my god! Hurt is fucking pissed! That was beautiful rage right there. If I may use my own, uh, something. Okay, you can die. Use the fucking King animation, that's what I like to see. He's very jittery though. Uh, alright, so, we just need Thief Man to land the finishing blow. Deuteragonist? More like, protagonist now. Ah, oh, this is another reference. Well then. <laughs> it seems that reasoning, strangely enough- Oh, there's the critical hit. Now that's just crappy level design. I don't- Uh, alright. <laughs> well, I got the gem. 
I assume that is uh, 10 gold exact. Yep, good. The glitch has not overwhelmed us. Oh, you just visit it. This better not be another cliffhanger ending. Too many of these rage fests have cliffhanger endings. Just have a normal conclusion. <laughs> Uh-oh. The end of your Let's Play has come. Who the heck is that? Oh no. Another battle, I, I assume? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. God damn it. <laughs> All right. Oh, wait, and we have this music going on here. All right, so he always heals back health. Rage, dark. Oh, that, yeah, that's pretty powerful. Okay, so he can't move, which means that I am free to kick the shit out of Marky. I don't have any way to really get by Mark's defenses. Does he have a skill? Renew, all I know, gets regains him health. So I guess what we'll do is we'll hang back and not do anything. Ah, there we go. He attacks Marky Joe. Yeah, drop the moon on him for sure. And that's what I'm talking about. Okay, is it over now, please? I know, shit. Wait, do we have a new member? Man, how am I still alive? It's Crom! Yay! Yeah, we got a new member, it's me. Which means I get to contribute to the final boss fight. Yeah! I love this tune. Heaven shit. This kicks much ass. Oh, wow. One of my abilities is to rant? Hold on. Since we save stated, I have to see this. It's the Mark and Joe theme. It exists. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Yeah! <laughs> wow, really nice looking effect there, by the way. That's gonna be painful. Okay, so it doesn't kill me in one hit, which means... Where is it? Well, two hits, rather. Which means, if I give him this, uh, then things will be good. Because, as far as I'm concerned, I can just kind of outlast them. Oh, well, or we could actually just fight him with our other dudes. All right. I have no idea what those words meant. Pretty hype ending, though. Rage Dark. <laughs> That's such a stupid name for a tome. 
It's like, it originally it was Dark Rage, but you had to switch it around to make it sound stupid. <laughs> Alright. Oh, shit! Okay. I should have thought about that. Ooh, that you only meant well. I mean, nobody meant well in this situation. Marky Joe, do you have shitty con? Yeah, you have really bad- you have, like, no con to speak of. One last attack. Okay. Drains target's will. Okay. I guess what I'll do- well, since he doesn't move, I can sort of just take my sweet time with this. Why does he apparently have, like... Oh shit! Here it comes! I forgot what I was gonna say, because I was too wrapped up in the hype right there. Here we go. This song super hype. Holy fucking shit. Damn it. Yeah, for bread, man. D never forget about the bread. Oh, God, getting by. Oh my God, he fucking ended it. Wow, I literally ended that in two hits, I just realized, and most of that was because of critical hits. Well, that guy's done. Good thing he can't move. Alright, here we go. Ending time. Yay, we went- oh, it's Nicolas Cage! Well then. Oh, it's Zach. Oh, Kohai. Whoever the heck. There we go. Yeah, I mean, you know, being an influential bread deliverer probably meant something. Oh, that sucks. God, I... my... my... Text like that just goes through one eye and out the other, or however... I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, like, when it, when it's just nonsense text like that, I just can't read it. Because it's like, it's hard to put piece together what the hell is going on. Noting especially the bad level design. See? That makes me happy. I hope- I hope I do inspire people to, like, make better stuff. Yeah. I should probably mention that, like, I- I have been very negative in the past, and it can kind of- like, I think some people might have experienced that, like, just- Oh, Clockinator? Why Clockinator? Ah, uh, whatever. Who cares? Kohai, you fucker. You're the main difficulty of this hack.
well then. Gotta love how the music ended just there. Well, almost. Wait, that cheap gem wasn't actually worth anything? Dad, that sucks! Alright, what is this impossible thing before I leave forever? Because I've been seeing this a lot with uh, F.EXP stuff. Alright, this doesn't look any different. Okay, so until next time, hey! Wait, hold on. Until next time... Fucking stupid thing. Well... I think something broke. But wait, what was in that one house we never checked? I'm checking this house out. Alright, so... That didn't work. I need someone to review my FE hack. He needs to be someone who won't cut me slack. It's Monkey Joe, he's arrived from his golden chariot. And down he was.